Welcome back everyone to the fifth episode of Real Pro Stock. I'm so excited to chit chat with my good friend Derek Beach. With everything that's going on in 2020 with the vid and everything else, what are your thoughts with Real Pro Stock? Well, I tell you what, Liberty Gears Extreme Pro Stock and Reels Pro Stock, the championship battle is heating up without a doubt. You've got three major contenders, two with a Ford, one with a Chevrolet, and it's a battle between really the teams of the engine builders and the manufacturers right now. And we roll into the fourth race of the 2020 PDRA season right here at Virginia Motor Sports Park once again this weekend, and it's shaping up to be a barn burner event without a doubt. What are you thinking about Johnny Pluccino? Tell us about that. Johnny Pulcino and the, and the Ford Mustang that he's that he's uh, piloting right now is without a doubt a top contender for the PDRA World Championship here in 2020. Obviously, Pulcino wants to follow in his dad's footsteps and, and be a uh, be a PDRA champion, and he has the potential, he has the horsepower, and they have the knowledge to make that uh, make that happen once again this year. The knowledge and the strength. It seems like for the past three years, champion 2018, 2019, Outlaw 632, and now he's sitting on top halfway right. through the season, well positioned, just finished up elsewhere, racing elsewhere at the NHRA, took that trophy home too. The kid seems unstoppable. There is no doubt that Johnny Fulcino is on a hot streak. You know, he won the first race of the season. He run it up in the second race. Uh, he won He won just a few weeks ago here at Virginia Motorsports Park. He wins on the NHRA Tour, and now he brings it right back here to Virginia this weekend. The momentum is definitely on his side, but the thing is, is there's two drivers that are hot on his heels. He only has a one-round lead virtually over J.R. Carr, and J.R. Carr has a brand-new race car, the Chevrolet Camaro that he's campaigning. Absolutely a beautiful piece. Some of the, uh, some of the newest technology that is out there um, is on J.R. Carr's machine here this weekend. They've done a lot of testing, and you can't leave out one of the Mountain Motor Pro Stock's greats driving the Ford Mustang and Elijah Morton. Elijah Morton, wonderful job at NHRA. What a loss. I mean, 7,000, 6,000 of a second with that guy. Such a strong team. What a great family. J.R. Carr, top qualifier, I think, in every outing. Correct. He's always sitting on top, qualified one, going into eliminations. Uh, so he holds strong through eliminations the majority of the time. J.R. Carr is, he is the quickest car on the property. I think he's got the most horsepower right now, without a doubt. But there is no doubt in my mind that Elijah Morton and Johnny Pulcino has done a lot of testing. They've went and done some R&D, and they found more horsepower. Um, and consistency is key. Having a good reaction time and making that sure that race car goes A to B down the racetrack every single pass, especially in eliminations and even in qualifying, because qualifying is huge, because that's puts you on the ladder of where you're gonna where you're gonna end up for first round and, and maybe a potential upset. So each and every round is key right now, not only for points but for the overall championship and to try to advance maybe to a final round and hoist another PDRA 660, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you so much, Derek Beach, for appearing. And thank you so much, Roy Hills Drag Racing School, for coming on board with Real Pro Stock for the remainder of the 2020 season. They have two events left at Roy Hill Drag Racing School. So make sure you give them a call, 336-498-7964. Visit RoyHillDragRacingSchool.com for more information on those last two events for this 2020 season. And what is that? Ha! Ah, a little foreshadow. So back to the PDRA Summer Shootout by Callie's, presented by Callie's. And this is one of my favorite views at the Virginia Motorsports Park. Let me tell you, I love the top of the tower. It is awesome. All right, it's the first qualifying session. Larry O'Brien up in the right lane. Okay. There's your start. John Montecalvo in the left lane. Dave Hughes in the right lane. So 414 by Larry O'Brien. And a major move by Dave Hughes to the center line. Stephen Boone on a single pass. All right. Chris Powers left lane. Elijah Morton right lane. And a couple of 412s. All right.
beautiful Chevrolet Camaro in the left lane, JR Carr. Right lane, current points leader, Johnny Puccino with a 409, and that puts Johnny on top, 409. Elijah Morton with 412 flat, and Chris Powers, 4125 in third place currently. And back to that International Drag Racing Hall of Fame, that logo. Hmm, I wonder where we're going to see more of that. Very interesting. Dave Hughes with a nice burnout. Listen, um, everything else is over on the YouTube page. So go and follow, subscribe to the Limbo Guy at Large. And everything you don't see here, the test and tune, the extended interviews, the absolutely everything else, there's just so much. We can't put it all here. And that's a really nice improvement by Dave Hughes to 414. Good job, Dave. Justin Kirk, we didn't see him in the first round of qualifying. Big problems this weekend. And Stephen Boone, can he improve on that 416? So let's see what Justin Kirk has in the right lane. And also, let's see what uh, Stephen Boone has in the left lane here. Injured arm, hasn't made the last event or two. It'll be interesting to see how he does. Hope he's okay. Uh, but that first shot was pretty good, so everyone is in. And that's a story. That's a big story. And so we're on a nine-car ladder. And that's going to be interesting, okay? And we'll see how it all plays out. Hey, Racer Chick, what's up? How you doing? <laughs> Denise. Denise Schmidt, love her. Awesome lady. Okay, Monte Calvo right lane. We got uh, Larry O'Brien. So I think uh, Monte Calvo had a 23 on the first round. Yep. And uh, O'Brien was a 414. So let's see what happens here. Bracket cars there. Little improvement with Monte Calvo. Chevy Camaro is absolutely beautiful. Look at that thing, man. Unbelievable. I love this car so much. Oh, man. Elijah Morton, my man. Tough loss in the finals over at the NHRA. Uh, let's see what this guy could do this weekend. Come on, Elijah. I'm rooting for you, baby. Come on. Chino's still on top with that 409. Let's see what Chris has. Chris has been doing a lot of work. Sending that engine back for some more horsepower. So uh, a 
A lot of time, a lot of effort has gone into this ride. So come on, Chris, let's see it. Come on. Steady improvement, man. You can watch him. He's, uh, he's moving up. He's just continuously notching up, notching up. You can only hope and wonder, is he going to leave in third place on points after this event? So, not Chris. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh. Here we are, round three of real pro stock qualifying. The PDRA's summer shootout presented by Callis. Monte Calvo in the left lane, O'Brien in the right lane. Just hasn't been Monte Calvo's weekend. There's something going on with that car. There's something going on with that car. So, uh, everyone's in the show. The guys voted to have a nine car ladder. So, everyone's in the show. The best position to be in is top qualifier. You're going to be racing against the ghost car. He went 442. It's just not right for Monte Calvo. I feel so bad for him. It's crazy. in that first round of qualifying. Uh, 419, everyone's in. So uh, let's see if these guys can improve their position. But once again, Pluccino sitting on top. I mean, he's the guy in control. That's, he gets to race the ghost car. He could have two, he's got a uh, ghost car and then he's got a buy, I believe. Uh, so everyone's fighting for that top position. They need it. Nice, Johnny. Nice. Yeah, so JR currently sitting third. Uh, Chris Power second. Johnny Puccino is first, pushing it. Even further, 409 with a five. So let's see, boys. Let's see what we can do here. car pretty much stays in the same position. So we're looking for Chris Powers to uh, push him. See if he's got any last ditch efforts here to see if he can knock Johnny Puccino off the top spot. Come on. So 4-10-9, that's not going to do it. Puccino goes in, top guy. Congratulations, Johnny Puccino, top qualifier. Go over to the limo guy at large. 
and check out the top qualifier interview. This is it. This is round one here. They go. They're going on. So Elijah Moore in left lane, Larry O'Brien right lane. And these guys are pretty much in the same neighborhood. Uh, 412, correction, yeah, 412 with Elijah and uh, Larry's right at 414, man. He's locked in at 414. So let's see how this one goes. just locked in man so Larry O'Brien's headed home Dave Hughes and Stephen Boone up next Dave Hughes in the right lane substantial step change improvement for Dave Hughes this weekend good job Dave Stephen Boone's moving on. Dave is headed home, and we got the stars here. We get the stars of drag racing with Wes Buck. Wes Buck's on the line, man. Wes Buck is tied to that Justin Kirk car. I think that's his dad's car. I'm not sure. I think that's what Wes was telling me. It's pretty cool. But he's taking serious interest in this car, man. He's He's there. Good seeing you, Wes. JR Carr moving on. Nice job over there, guys. Moving on, moving on. Calvo on the left lane is clearly struggling this weekend. Chris Powers. Chris Powers is powering on, man. Keep it up, Chris. Let's see what he's see what he's got in this round. Come on, Machine Gun Monty. What has he got up his sleeve? What is he going to do to Chris? Come on. as the underdog we've been struggling with this car it's not the car it's just you know we got some bugs somewhere could be carburetors we're not sure what it was we've changed everything so far so I went in as the underdog Scott and you know my goal this year we got the number one on the car won three championships my goal this year was just to go out and have fun spoke to Lois Ann before the run and said I think I'm gonna go up there and play a game a little bit she's hey Whatever you think, have fun. You know that's why so we're that here. It was completely intentional. It was intentional. John Montecalvo tried to double bump uh, Chris Powers, and he double bumped himself. Wow. So uh, okay. So moving on, moving on. John Johnny Pluccino up against the ghost car.
car almost beat you guys. That son of a bitch. We swapped lanes on him. We were going to go in the left lane. At the last minute, we swapped on him. We put him in the other lane. <laughs> Kicked our ass. You know what? <laughs> that goes cost. <laughs>
JR car. Right lane, Johnny Bellicino, left lane. Real pro stock semifinals. It's a PDRA summer shootout presented by Calix. Whole shot. Whole shot victory by Johnny Puccino. It is on a tear. Believe it. I think there's like a 40 minute turnaround here. Back to back pits. No John going, it's just working. Just getting it done. Turning these cars around. It's almost time to get back to the lanes. Who is going to win this episode? Real Pro Stock Episode 5, Virginia Motorsports Park. It's a PDRA summer shootout presented by Cali's. Oh yeah. <laughs> Real Pro Stock Finals, the Summer Shootout, presented by Callie's. I don't know. This will be good. No doubt now that uh, Chris Powers should be exiting uh, this facility with the third position uh, at a minimum. So... What's it gonna be? Here we go. Final preparations have been made. Cars are sealed up. Let's get them in the beams. Wow, he's got a wheelie. Oh, man. <laughs> Another whole shot win. And he had a wheelie. Oh, man. Congratulations, Johnny Pluccino. What a great job, man. What a great season you guys got running. The Strutmasters.com Ford Mustang is slaying this season. Unbelievable. And to the victor go the spoils. Off to victory lane. There he is. You guys, come on. Come on, Limo. Congratulations, guys. What about the big woo? One, two, three. Woo! On the count of three, a big woo. Ready? One, two. Woo! All right, there you go. It's awesome, man. How does it feel, man? Come on, tell me. It's great. I mean, everyone, everyone, it doesn't, it doesn't get old. It doesn't, it doesn't get uh, less special. Um, it's, it's amazing to do this. I, I dreamed about this for a long time. I have the most amazing sponsor in the entire world. Uh, Trip Lofton is, believes in us and he supports us and he's here until the late hours of the night with us celebrating and uh, this, 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 this crew and this team is just, uh, we got heart man, we got heart. Right and remember go over to the YouTube page, the Limo Guy at Large YouTube and check out all of the additional material for this race. There he is my buddy Monday Morning Racer and someday that little kid is going to be ripping that trophy out of Johnny's hands. Congratulations, Johnny and Team Pluccino. Take care, guys. Thank you so much, everyone, for appearing. Thank you, Judy Tommy Franklin, for allowing me to attend PDRA events with unfettered access. That needs to be said. Thank you to all my sponsors. New sponsors, Roy Hills Drag Racing School. Make sure you're checking out them. Uh, Strutmasters.com. We're going to get you in the next production. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.